to. This is a happy day. I'm so pleased at your soulmate. He's the best. He is. He's perfect for you. You look so nice. It's good to see you. Me too. <laughs> That's my <okay. laughs> so Last night, I had to get a piece of paper from the hotel. I'm surprised it doesn't say Fairfield on it. And it does. Oh, it does? <laughs> <laughs> That's what they had at the front desk. So. <laughs> So Reese and Kendall, I've known you now. I was trying to figure it roughly seven years. And one thing that I know to be true about both of you guys is that both of you are the kind of people who are all in people. And I know that that's how it will be in this marriage as well. You're gonna be all in together and I have no doubt that that's what we'll get to see. And it's exciting. I really wanna kiss you, but I don't think I'm allowed to yet. Lord, thank you for Kendall. Help me to just be a good steward of what you've given me um, with her. Um, help me to just love her well. Um, I just love her so much, Lord. So just help me to love her well. For a long time, people were telling us to date, but you and I are the same type of stubborn. So we took a while to reach our own conclusions. When we met freshman year of college, I thought you were this goofy dude who had a flat top hairdo. Rode his longboard everywhere and thought he was the coolest person on the block. That's true. <laughs> I promise to always fight for you, pursue you, and love you unconditionally for the rest of my life. And I promise to always help you look for your wallet and keys, even when you say you've looked everywhere. For it's only going to get worse from here. <laughs> I'm so excited to spend the rest of our lives together as teammates, best friends, husband and wife. The Lord has truly blessed us. I love you so much. You may kiss your bride. Allow me to introduce to you today for the very first time, Reese and Kendall Layberger. Give it up again for them. always said that you were the young man that we've been dreaming of for Kendall. When I asked him as father, what are your intentions with this young lady, Kendall? And he flat out told me that day, I plan on marrying her dad. Dad, she's my best friend. And that was all I needed to hear. Reese showed me who God was to him. Um, and at the time, 
I was not a Christian. With the help of nine or ten other guys in our small group, and of course Reese was a huge impact on me, um, I got baptized. Uh, you hold Kendall's heart with care, you give her confidence, and encourage her to be guided by Christ. We love that you're a part of our family, and I am pleased and happy that you're my son. Both Kendall and Reese have been like a family to me for the past couple years, and for that, I am eternally grateful. Just that love and faithfulness that you guys have shown me represents who you guys are every day. I feel like I could talk for hours on the love that you guys have shown me and the love that you have shown everyone in this room. As the days, weeks, and months pass, I saw my friends fall more and more in love with each other. And I know everyone who has witnessed your love for each other has also witnessed the love of God. To best friends and the sweetest God-written love story. I love you guys. So excited to spend the rest of our lives together as teammates, best friends, husband and wife. I am so honored to be standing here with you today as your wife. Get that bad wife out there.